Right now, they are angry and they're frustrated and they're taking their concerns to city council. Thanks for staying with NBC Charlotte, everyone. I'm Sarah French. And I'm Fred Shropshire. A group of people living in Charlotte's South End neighborhood say they've been dealing with disruptive motorcyclists late at night for months. Take a look. <laughs> You just saw two men who appear to be racing in the street. This is an issue we've reported on before. We've seen bikes and ATVs terrorizing drivers everywhere from Billy Graham Parkway to South Boulevard and 277 to Brookshire Boulevard. NBC Charlotte's Lexi Wilson talked to people living in the area who tell us they want change now. Well, the woman I spoke to says this has been going on for years and nothing has been done about the noise or reckless driving. She says Tuesdays are the worst here at Hot Taco. Now she's hoping to take action, hoping the crowd goes somewhere else. Caught on camera. A swarm of motorcyclists turning the streets of South End into a dangerous playground. I'm frustrated. The building is frustrated. South End resident Linda Weigel fed up with the constant noise. They leave at 2 in the morning. They're out there riding around crazy and nobody's monitoring it. Monday night, Weigel and a group of South End residents will stand before city council to voice their concerns. Stating the city ordinance says it's unlawful when the vehicle is being operated in a manner so as to create unreasonably loud and disturbing noises. There's a point where you've got to respect each other. Weigel says she's called police several times, but nothing has changed. We've seen similar incidents before. ATV and dirt bike riders have been spotted in Uptown on Billy Graham Parkway and 277. They're probably going to murder us. At the light rail in South End, a man was seriously hurt after he bypassed the lights and gates crossing in the path of the train. If one of them crash, it could be a domino effect. And police say if you see a group racing, you should slow down and pull off to the side of the road, then call 911. As for Weigel, she hopes city council will take action. Reporting in South End, I'm Lexi Wilson for NBC Charlotte.